What's going on my fragrance family? You know it's your boy Shemo back at it again with another video. Guys, I do hope as always that this video finds you in good health. In this channel we talk about fragrances, lifestyle and how to use the art of fragrance to attract the woman of your dream. So if you're new to this channel, you happen to be passing by for the first time and you do like fragrance reviews and unboxing of fragrances and also giveaways. I ask that you stop for a moment, watch a video, drop a like on the video and if you take anything of interest or substance from any one of my videos then consider subscribing to the channel as well because it does help the channel to grow and it also ensures that whenever I upload a video you get it straight to your phone and you can come and rock with me and also just be a part of the Shemo fragrance family. Today I want to talk to you guys about the top 30 ultimate fragrance buying guide for 2023 and I have divided the fragrance into categories of five. The first category being cheap, versatile, date night, long lasting scent, office fragrance and niche fragrances. So I have five honorable mention before I begin. It's going to be a long video so I will start right away. So let's get down to the honorable mentions. The first honorable mention is Nautica Voyage. This one is a cheap fragrance. It opens up with the apple and it dries down pretty sweet. It is a fragrance that will get you compliment because it smells amazing. So I recommend you to check this one out. Very cheap and it is a very long lasting scent as well. Then we have another honorable mention for the versatile category and this one is Prada Black. This one is a musky fragrance. It has a sweet vanilla but it does open up with the bergamot. And this one adds versatility to the fragrance so it opens a little bit fresh and it dries down sweet so you can wear this one just about anywhere anytime and you are guaranteed to get compliment next one we have for the date night and this one is one million lucky this one is a sweet and nutty fragrance i've talked about this one a lot because it is a great fragrance for a compliment and a perfect fragrance for a date night Try this one out, one million lucky. Then we have for the long lasting category, this one is Al Hermain Amber Oud Tobacco Edition. This is a tobacco fragrance, a very strong and animalic in your face tobacco fragrance that gets compliment. If you love tobacco, you will love this fragrance. So I recommend you to try this one out, Al Hermain Amber Oud Tobacco Edition. Now for the office fragrance category, we have another honorable mention and this one is Chanel Allure Homme Sport, the OX Trem. This one, it opens a little bit fresh and it dries down sweet. Very good fragrance for a compliment. You can wear this one to the office and you will smell great. So try this one out guys, Chanel Allure Homme Sport, a great office fragrance. Then we have for the niche category, this one is Black Phantom from Killian. This is a sweet gourmand fragrance. This one smells like you can eat it. Dark chocolate and caramel, vanilla. A beautiful fragrance. I recommend you to try this one. It is a great fragrance that you will love because you will get compliment. Wear this one in a cuddle body situation and your person will want to be in your arms when you smell like this. So try this one out. Black Phantom from Killian. Now we move on to the top tier fragrances. The fragrances that are the ultimate fragrances that you need to get for this particular situation for 2023. So the first cheap one that I have on the list is Bentley Intense for Men. This is a boozy leather fragrance and it smells absolutely amazing. Very cheap and is a great compliment getter. So if you want a fragrance for a compliment that is cheap, try Bentley Intense for Men. It is lovely and you'll get compliments when you wear it. The next one we have for the cheap category is Calvin Klein CK1 Summer. This is a summer fragrance and it is a very good fragrance as well. When this one is sprayed, you just get a burst of citrus. It is not really a very long lasting scent, but it does smell great. This is a fragrance that you can keep in your gym bag or you keep this one in your car. You just refresh on the go because it is cheap and you don't have to worry about the sprays you take from this one. So CK1 Summer, 
this one is a very good cheap fragrance that will garner you attention. Next we have Isimiyaki the original. For all of you guys who have been in the fragrance world for a very long time, you would have known Isimiyaki. This fragrance, it smells so good with the Yuzu note. It's a fragrance that just smells timeless. This one will forever be around because it is a great fragrance for the heat and it's a fragrance that will get you compliment. Very cheap as well, but it is a fragrance that you can wear with confidence and you know you're not gonna smell unique, but you're gonna smell great. It's Miyake and this one is the original. Next one on the list is Salvatore Faragamo F Black. This one is a peppery fragrance. It opens up with an apple note and it dries down really peppery and sweet. It is a fragrance that you can dress up or dress down, which I recommend you most of all to dress this fragrance up because when you wear this fragrance, you smell elegant, you smell rich, you smell like you got your shit together. That is how Salvatore Ferragamo F Black smell. Very cheap, but it's a very good fragrance and need not to say it is a very long lasting scent as well. So try this one out guys, Salvatore Ferragamo F Black. The final one in the cheap category is Halloween Man X. This one is a coffee fragrance, it's a sweet coffee fragrance, so if you love coffee, you will love this fragrance. This one is a compliment getter as well and it's a fragrance that lasts forever in a day but it did not make the long lasting list but it's a great fragrance guys very cheap so I suggest you get this one in your collection you will love it Halloween Man X a great cheap fragrance for compliment now we move on to the versatile category versatile in the sense that these fragrances you can wear them just about anywhere and you won't have to worry that you're gonna offend the people around you because these fragrances, while being sweet and sexy, they're not aggressive. So the first one that I have on the list is Hermes H24. This is a recent acquisition of mine, but it is a fragrance that I love. I wore this one to the gym, and I wore this one when I'm going out casually, and I get compliments when I do. This one is a musky fragrance, and it smells great. I recommend you try this one out guys if you love a musky fragrance that smells great then you will love Hermes H24 next one on the versatile list is a limited edition parfum and this is a Club de Nuit Intense Man this is a great fragrance from the house of Armagh either a representation of the Creed fragrance or a clone but this one smells great it opens fresh and it dries down sweet it's a great fragrance for a compliment Thus, it is a versatile fragrance. You wear this one just about anywhere. You won't offend anyone and you will smell great and you will get compliment, guys. You will get compliment. That I can tell you from wearing Club de New Intense Man, more preferably the limited edition parfum version. Very sweet, very sexy, and it's a great compliment getter. Try this one out. Next one on the list is Armani Code the Other Parfum. It is not as sweet as the rest of the Armani fragrances, thus making this one a versatile fragrance. Opens up a little bit fresh and dries down a little bit sweet. Perfect for any occasion and it's a great compliment getter. So try this one out, Armani Code, the Auto Perform version. Next we have a fragrance that whenever you're talking about a versatile list, you cannot leave Versace Dylan Blue from this list. It is a blue fragrance, very aquatic, very citrusy, and it is also sweet. It gets a lot of compliment, and this is a long-lasting fragrance as well. But it is so versatile, guys, you wear this one anywhere, anywhere, and you will get compliments when you do. Try Versace Dylan Blue out, guys. If you know this one, you know what I'm talking about, but if you don't, you need to get your nose on it. It's a great, versatile fragrance for compliment. Next one on the versatile list, and the last one on the versatile list is Dior Sauvage the Eau de Toilette. You guys know this fragrance. It is a very peppery fragrance, and this one has bergamot. It smells so good, guys. This is a great fragrance to wear just about anywhere. Hands down, you will get compliment from everyone. Well, not everyone, but those who desire to give you compliment. But it is a compliment monster, guys. This fragrance pulls compliment from the people around you. Granted, it is not a fragrance that is unique because the DNA 
it's been watered down and everybody's wearing their savage these days but if you want compliment if you want a versatile fragrance Dior Sauvage can be the fragrance for you. So try this one out, guys. Now we move on to the date night category. And these are the fragrances that I love. I love to wear sweet and sexy fragrances on dates. So without any further ado, let's go. The first one is Dulce & Gabbana, the one, the Eau Parfum. You guys know this fragrance. Man, it is good. This fragrance has the sweet and sexy vanilla note and it dries down to a powdery scent. The ladies love this one, thus making this fragrance a perfect date night scent. So sexy, so inviting, so cuddly and it's a great fragrance guys. This is a 5.1 ounce bottle and I recommend you, if you're getting this fragrance, get this big bottle because you're going to love it and you're going to want to use it and you're going to have to refill. So just get the big one guys and use the fragrance. It is so sexy for a date night. Dulce & Gabbana the one, the other perform. Next one on the list is another favorite of mine and this one is Stronger With You Intensely. This is a sweet and gourmand fragrance. On date you want to wear an edible fragrance. You want to wear a fragrance that smells sexy and inviting. This is a fragrance that you can wear. Stronger With You, the Intensely version. Guys, oh, this one is so sweet. It has a toffee note and it smells so amazing. Guys, just get this one in your collection. You will love it. You will smell great when you go out there and your person will want to be close to you. That is the reason why we wear these fragrances on dates. Next one I have on the list is Spice Balm Extreme. This is a great vanilla fragrance. Spicy vanilla fragrance. Perfect for a date night. Just go light on the spray when you're wearing this one because it is strong, but it is sexy. Peppery, sweet, vanilla fragrance that have the ladies just keep coming to you. You will get some weird compliments with this fragrance because it smells so good, guys. So try this one out, guys. Spice Bomb Extreme, a great fragrance for a date night. Then you have my favorite from the house of Azaro, and this one is Azaro Wanted by Night. It is a great date night scent and this one I love. Sweet and sexy and inviting. Just try this one. The other Azaro fragrance, they're great also, but this is the one that I love the most and this is the one that I recommend you to buy. If you're looking for an Azaro fragrance to wear on a date, hands down, Azaro Wanted by Night is the best choice that I'll tell you to get, guys. It's amazing. Last one on the list of date night fragrance is La Nuit de L'Homme from Yves Saint Laurent. You guys know this one would have made the list. This is just so sexy. The cardamom and the lavender that is in the fragrance make it smell really, really good. It is not a beastly projecting fragrance. This one is more of a close encounter fragrance. But when the person smells this fragrance on you, man, you're going to smell so sexy. Try this one out for a date night, guys. You will love it. And the person around you will also love this scent profile. Lana Weed Alum from East Saint Laurent. The final date night fragrance. Now we move on to the long lasting category. In the long lasting category of fragrance, we're talking about fragrances that projects, has beastly projection. Fragrances that last up to 24 hours. And fragrances that smells amazing, but they still do not offend the people around you. Well, there's one fragrance in the list that is so strong that if you're not desiring of that fragrance, then it might be a hit or miss, but it's a great fragrance. So I kick it off with the long lasting fragrance. The first one on the list is John Paul Gaultier Ultra Male. This one is a party playboy fragrance that smells so good and it lasts forever in a day. You spray this one on your clothes, the next day you will smell the scent on your clothes. That is how strong it is. I recommend you only go five sprays with this fragrance. Depending on the situation you're going in, you can go a little bit less. But it is a potent, very long lasting fragrance and it gets compliment most importantly. Then we have Versace Eros Parfum. This is the strongest of the Versace fragrances. 
This one opens up with the mint and it dries down sexy and sweet with the vanilla. A beautiful fragrance for compliment that lasts all day. I suggest you to get this one guys. If you're looking for a Versace fragrance, this is the one that you need to get. If you're looking for a Versace Eros fragrance more specifically, get Eros Parfum. Very sweet, very sexy, very inviting, very long lasting and is a great compliment getter. Next one on the list of long lasting scent is Carolina Herrera Bad Boy Le Parfum. This is a very long lasting fragrance. It utilizes the cannabis note in this fragrance and it smells so good guys. This one is a fragrance that will last up to 24 hours and you will get compliments when you wear this one. Just try this one out guys. If you like green earthy fragrance with cannabis and sweetness, you will love Carolina Herrera Bad Boy Le Parfum. Next one on the list of long lasting scent is Red Tobacco from the House of Mancera. This is a fragrance that I love. This is a fragrance I'm telling you about that if you're not desiring of tobacco, or if you're not desiring of a fragrance that is in your face in a sexy way, then you might want to stay away from red tobacco. But it is a very strong and very potent fragrance that gets compliment. It is very long lasting, guys. This one, 24 hours and beyond. This one can be a hit or miss. When I first smelled this fragrance, I didn't like it that much, but then it grew on me. It's a great fragrance, very long lasting scent. Try this one out, guys. Red Tobacco from the House of Mencer. And the final one that I have on the list of long lasting scent, this one is Dior Sauvage the Elixir. This is 24 hours and beyond, guys. This is a very, very long lasting scent. Very good fragrance for a compliment. It is a fragrance that stands out and it is a fragrance that everybody knows and everybody loves. Dear Savage Elixir guys, try this one out. I'll show you again. Try this one out. It's a very long lasting scent, 24 hours and beyond. The next category of fragrance is office fragrance. The first one is Brioni Eau de Parfum. This is a green, musky, earthy fragrance. And this one is a great one for the office. It is not a fragrance that will drown anyone out around you, but it is a fragrance that will project and get you noticed. Try this one out for the office, guys. Brioni or the Parfum. It's a great fragrance to wear in the springtime as well. I love this one and I want you to try it out. You'll get compliments when you wear it. Next one on the list is Dior Homme Intense. This is an iris based fragrance. Iris and lavender. That is what you get with Dior Homme Intense. Very sexy and it's a great fragrance to wear to the office. Mind you, only go with three sprays of this fragrance in the office because it is strong. But the people around you will smell this scent and they will know that it is you if you make this fragrance your signature scent. Because it can be a great signature scent. Wear this one to the office guys, you will smell great and you will get compliments when you do. Dior Homme Intense and this is a 2020 version. Next one on the list is Prada Lum the Eau de Parfum version. This one is a very luxurious scent. It smells like you're just coming from the shower and you've used an expensive body wash. That is how this one smells. Fresh and clean scent and this one will make you smell great in the office. Try this one out for an office fragrance guys. The person around you will love your scent profile and you will enjoy it too. Prada Lum the Eau de Parfum version. Great fragrance for the office. Then you have YSLY Le Parfum. This one is a great fragrance. It opens up sweet and fresh and it dries down sweet and fresh. This one has the lavender in the middle of it that adds some depth and life to the fragrance. It smells really great and it is not offensive. It's not offensive guys and it's not a fragrance that is weak. Very long lasting scent, very good performing fragrance that garners compliment perfect for the office and you will get compliments when you wear this one in the office setting. Try this one out, this one is YSLY Le Parfum. Now the final one on the list of office fragrance is Aqua Digio Profumo from Giorgio Armani. This one is regarded as the best office fragrance for men and that is so true because 
it is just fresh and clean and sexy and gentleman like this is a fragrance that gets you compliment and it just smells great guys I recommend you to get this one in your collection aquatic great great fragrance I love this one and you will love it too once you start wearing this fragrance and if you want to make this one a signature scent for you you definitely can perfect fragrance for the office that gets you compliment Aquadigio Profumo from Giorgio Armani try this one out guys you will love it now we move on to the niche category of fragrances niche meaning expensive niche meaning high-end fragrances niche meaning expensive ingredients in fragrances and niche meaning not easily accessible fragrances the first one on the list is Creed Viking you guys know my stand on this fragrance this is a gentleman's fragrance an elegant fragrance this one sets you apart from the other people around you it is a unique fragrance and it is a compliment getter I wore this one last night and I got a compliment from a girl she stuck to me like glue saying that she's not gonna leave because of the way that I smell so if you want an experience like that guys wear Creed Viking it is very expensive about $500 but it is a great fragrance for a compliment and it stand out next one on the list is from the house of parfums de Marley and this one is Herod the girls magnet this one is sweet and vanilla and it is also spicy so if you like spicy sweet fragrance that reminds you of spice bomb extreme for the date night then definitely this is a fragrance you need to get parfums de Marley Herod. Try this one out, a niche fragrance guy that smells absolutely amazing and great at getting compliments. I love this one. I want you to try it. You will love it too. Next one on the list is Creed Aventus. This is regarded as the king of fragrances. In my opinion though, I don't really see that because this fragrance DNA is being watered down everywhere you go these days you will smell someone that smells like Creed Aventus. It does not have to be the Creed Aventus fragrance, but there are so many clones out there of this fragrance, guys, but this is still a champion. Very good fragrance, but I would not really suggest you to go ahead and buy this one, guys, because you can get so many clones that smells even better than Creed Aventus for a fraction of the price. So why would you waste your money to get a fragrance unless you want to have the name in your collection so if somebody says what you're wearing then you can say I'm wearing Creed Aventus so it boosts your status right but if it's because of the scent profile I wouldn't really recommend you to buy Creed Aventus guy there's so many dupes out there just get one of them and you will love it Al Hermain LaVenture Intense Club de Nuit Intense Man Limited Edition Parfum Club de Nuit Intense Man The Eau de Toilette those are just some of the clone that smells like Creed Aventus guys and they're very long lasting scent but this is still a great masterpiece you have to give honor where honor belongs because this one is the original so you respect the craftsmanship in the original fragrance so Creed Aventus you can still buy it if you have the money to spend and you want to boost your status with the name so that is it for Creed Aventus guys then we have Initios Oud for greatness. This, in my opinion, is the best beginner friendly oud fragrance. And even though I say beginner friendly oud fragrance, it is still a very powerful fragrance. It is still a fragrance that gets you compliment and it is still a fragrance that will last a very long time. But the oud in this fragrance does not come across too strong and too animalic in your face so that it will turn your mind and your heart away from the oud note. It is not like that. This one is a more subtle take on the oud note while being very strong and very potent and pulls compliment. If you're a beginner to the note of oud, this is a fragrance you can try. It's very expensive as well, almost $500 for a 3.4 ounce bottle. But it's a great fragrance for compliment. It will leave you smelling very animalic and manly and you will get compliments from the ladies. The final one on the list of niche fragrance is Nishane 
Hasivat. If you guys know this fragrance, then you know it is hands down a great fragrance. Perfect for a hot day, perfect for a date night, perfect for whatever situation you throw at this fragrance. It opens up with a bright and sexy pineapple note and it dries down to a sweet, woodsy, somewhat of a leathery fragrance, but it smells really good. It is not a clone of Creed Aventus, but it does have the same trait of the DNA, but in the dry down, it goes in a total separate way. So it's a great fragrance, guys, and I recommend you to try this one out if you want a fragrance that is fresh and clean, versatile, that gets compliment and has the niche quality behind it. Nishane Hasivad. Try this one out, guys. You will definitely love and appreciate this fragrance. So there you have it, guys. A very long list of the top ultimate buying guide fragrances for 2023. So if you're looking for fragrances to start your collection, these are some fragrances that you can look into. You will get compliments when you wear them. You will smell great out there. And most of all, you will love these fragrances yourself. The link for these fragrances will be in the video description below. So if you are interested, definitely go ahead and check these fragrances out. Tell me also in the comment section below, what are some fragrances that you have picked up in 2023 that you absolutely love? And again, thank you for watching my videos. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel for future videos. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Have a great day, guys.